what is up guys it's your boy Chris coming back to you with another video today I am out here actually earlier than I usually am because today is the research day for shiny Celebi and I'm really excited about this now I've already seen some spoilers on certain things we expect some awesome things today and I just I'm really excited Rufflet is now spawning and will be in raids. The new Pikachu is here and just a whole lot is spawning today and I'm really excited. So I am starting this video at Frontier. Look at these spawns right here. There is Dwebbles, uh, Woobats, Caterpies, Diglets, all over the place. Now there is a lot of shiny potential during this event and hopefully you guys you can you can hear me because it seems like it's a little busy this morning surprisingly but let's get into the research with Jesse and James oh so cool they show up and they wave to you hey James did you hear what is it Jesse apparently there's a mysterious Pokemon in a jungle nearby go on they say it's called the protector of the of the jungle or something like that oh that sounds like a kind of pokemon the boss would be happy to see it's going to be a pain though since we don't really know the area hmm maybe we can con someone into helping us yeah huh hey you you must be an assistant the boss sent you yeah why else would someone be out here in the middle of nowhere well you know if you're gonna go on a Pokemon journey, you're gonna end up in some really weird places. Assistant, of course. An assistant, the boss has high expectations for us after all. Now that you're here, let's go get to work. Okay, Jesse and James, don't, don't over, you know, count yourself as one of the best Team Rocket. We all know what Ash did to you. All right, let's see what we have to do. Transfer 10 Pokemon, catch 10 grass type, and evolve three grass types, and that's it for the first step this is super easy to do the only part that takes the longest is battling Jesse and James apparently they have not been spawning really really good and a lot of people have tweeted about it that they're just not showing up and I'm hoping I don't have that problem I want to grind this through so fast to get shiny Celebi hopefully it's good IVs I'm pretty sure a lot of people hope for that hopefully a Shundo that would be amazing I would brag about that so much now real quick if you guys did not know they did tell us what the new shadows are and what the spawns we should look forward to so jesse's team is shadow scyther the new shiny shadow ekans and stantler james's new shiny shadow is pincer with coughing and grimer now other than those the new spawns we have is caterpie pikachu diglet hoot hoot nuzleaf Rog and Rolla, Woobat, Drillbur, Cottony, Dwebble, and Durant. All of those are spawning. A good amount of those can be a shiny. So I'm going to hope for the best. I really want that Pikachu. If you guys know me, I love my Pikachus in costumes and hats. But I also want a Caterpie. And Rog and Rolla, I do need them. Dwebble, I need one. Woobat, I'm not worried about. I have a Durant that someone traded to me. So let's get to it. I thought I'd just let you guys know what the spawns are to look forward to.
I am now in Minden Park, still grinding away the first step. I am almost done catching 10 grass types, then I will evolve three, and 11 days until Christmas. Yes, it's somewhat snowed here in Gardnerville, Minden area. This isn't really snow, this is like a sheet. They're just like, here, take it, have it. But I am so close to completing the first set of this research. And I do have a one star raid in 15 minutes that could possibly be Rufflet. So cross my fingers it is, because I really want Rufflet. I have completed the first set of the Celebi research for Shiny Celebi. So I get 20 Ultra Balls and two spawns. The reward is another spawn, Stardust, and XP. You know, I looked into what we get out of this and I completely forgot, so let's see what we get. We get a Nuzleaf. <laughs> Go find some grass types. We're giving you a Nuzleaf for the reward. Alright, so first reward down, and it is a Nuzleaf. Two and three. Alright. Oh, Explorer Hat Pikachu first. No, it is not. But I'm also going to check that Caterpie because I do not have Shiny Caterpie still. Believe it or not, I don't have that one. Alright, reward number two. Cottony. Maybe I might check these. I might keep them just in case they are good IVs. Second reward is down. Alright, third and final. We get Stardust, XP, and another spawn, which is a Diglett. All, uh, only the Diglett could have been shiny. I don't know if there was a chance. I don't think they ever said that we could get a shiny out of it, but I assume we could. And down that one goes. Diglett is caught. All right, let's check out the next step. They wave again. Nice work, kid. I can't believe you actually did it. Yeah, it feels nice to have somebody to boss around. I mean, uh, somebody to help us out. Jesse and I are constantly on our feet, you know? Okay, James, try to cover it up. As you can imagine, it is hard for us to maintain our good looks when we're always running around like this. Anyway, you did your bit, so I guess we can let you take a break. Oh, how sweet of them. Superb idea, Jesse. It's important to change up the pace every once in a while. Go on and spend some time with your buddy. I'll play with your buddy 10 times, take a snapshot of a grass type Pokemon, give your buddy 10 treats. I can do that, super easy. All right guys, because I completely forgot about it, right now I am doing the next step. But we do get five snapshots each day until this event ends, which goes on until the 21st of this month. So, the photo bombs are Jesse and James, and you either get a Meow spawn or a Wobbuffet spawn, and they can be shiny from the snapshots. So after I'm done playing with my Quacksire a couple more times, I am going to be checking the snapshot that I already have for the first one, and then I'll do four more to see if I get a shiny out of them.
right, so I did complete the second step of the Celebi research. So I get a Poffin and a Pokemon Spawn, which is a Combi. I'm pretty sure you could get a female out of it if you're lucky enough. I'm not worried about it, even if I got a female. I have a bunch of females. I find them very often. And I already have a couple of evolution forms of Combi. Can't think of the name at the moment because this is way more important. All right, Combi, you're being stubborn. So let me down. Let me know down in the comments. How'd you guys do with your community today over the weekend? I ended with 61 shinies. <laughs> That's honestly more than I thought I would get. All right, that one's down. And that egg that did hatch, it was a Pikachu. I might do it. Oh, Cherubi. That's a, actually a really, really cool reward. You don't see those very often. They're not hatched very often either. Cher oh, Cherubi. Said that wrong. A Cherubi. There we go. Eh, not bad IVs. Alright, let's check this. Stardust, XP... And mysterious Pokemon encounter a pincer that could have been shiny but I don't think like I said I don't know if they gave us the chance of it being shiny out of the research I assume it would be like I said earlier I, I assume it would be I'm pretty sure some people have gotten a shiny from the research all right let's see what Jesse and James have to say now oh let me let me give you a nice wave I'm so glad the boss sent you sent along someone so useful to help us now that you mention it you haven't told us anything about yourself you haven't told us anything about yourself where are you normally stationed how long have you been with team rocket oh what's your favorite thing about the boss do tell uh, i'm not part of team rocket hey why so quiet all of a sudden jesse who actually told told you that we'd be getting an assistant? Nobody told me anything. Well, no one told me either. But you're the one who said they were sent by the boss. I said no such thing. Okay, James, I have you on camera. You did say. Hey, who exactly are you? Da 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 da. You better start talking. Ah, I knew you were just no good, just a no good twerp. Hey, personal. My feelings are hurt. This whole thing was suspicious from the start. Did someone send you to get in our way? Yeah, that must be it. I trusted you. I thought you were one of us. You know too much. We can't let you go. Let's get him, James. Don't you dare get in our way. You'll regret it. Don't you know who we are? Well, let us formally introduce ourselves. Prepare for trouble and make it double. Oh my god. To protect the world of devastation. To annihilate all people. Hey, are you even listening? No. Defeat Jesse and James four times. So, I know it sounds like you need to do a balloon four times. But it's actually you just need to do a balloon twice. Because you fight Jesse and James and then you fight him again. That's four. I need to make five great curveball throws and hatch three eggs. Let's get to it, guys. Shout out to my man Alex that I actually just ran into not that long ago. He was here getting some stops and stuff, shiny checking, but he just sent me an invite for a rufflet. My first rufflet raid. Hopefully, it's shiny. Imagine my first rufflet raid being shiny. That would be absolutely insane. I don't even want to stop recording, honestly. I'm going to pause the screen recording, but I just don't want to miss my initial reaction just in case it is a shiny because this is going to be absolutely insane if you, you you know this is just absolutely insane all right here we go we have started the rufflet raid oh my god this would be absolutely insane so i watched fleece king last night he was streaming this event he did do 20 rufflet raids and then he finally got the shiny so it could be a 1 in 20 odds of it being shiny 1042 it's 1065 is the weather boosted come on ah oh, not shiny 
Oh, that would have been amazing if it was. All right, let's catch it. All right, guys. So I was able to complete two parts of the third set of the research for Celebi because I am waiting on Justine James. Seems like it takes them a really long time. And people have said it's six hours and then you get one. So let's check the first reward spawn. It is a Hoot Hoot. <laughs> Missed opportunity for releasing that shiny on this event. It would have been nice. Shiny Noctowl is awesome. All right, that is down. Number two. Oh, that's actually a really cool spawn, a Whimsicott. That's really cool, I'm not gonna lie. I have no shinies from spawns yet, uh, sadly. <laughs> but let's keep going and hopefully I can get a shiny during while I'm out. I just got my final Meowth balloon. I need to get my shiny Celebi. And I actually just went out. I had my dad drive me around Minden Park for the Pikachu Spotlight Hour. 
because I really wanted the shiny. I got home and boom, I got Jesse and James. Thank God. Now I can complete the Celebi quest. Hopefully I can get a shadow shiny. We will see. This has been a long waited for because Jesse and James do not spawn very often. Every six hours a balloon shows up. You either get Jesse or James or you don't. And I got one yesterday and I got my final one today. So let's claim Celebi. Oh my god, this, this is so much. I get the shiny Pikachu in the costume during spotlight. And now I'm about to get Shiny Celebi after I go through all the parts and catching whatever's before Celebi. So I'm looking for $13.99. That is the hundo. If I can get anything close to that, I would be very happy because I really want to get a good Shiny Celebi. Now, before I go on, I will show you my other Celebi. So the other Celebi I got was actually only an 80%. It wasn't great. So let's get into this. Yeah, wave. I can't believe we were defeated by a twerp like you. That was not. T that was totally unexpected. What will the boss say? I mean, you kind of let him down multiple times, huh? Hey, behind you, isn't that Celebi? Could that be the so-called protector of the jungle? Drat, that Pokemon was supposed to be ours. Mark our words. We'll get you next time. We're blasting off again. All right. So claim the XP. Now we gotta claim these things before we get our shiny Celebi. Alright, so let's catch this Oddish. Ho hopefully, it could be good IVs, who knows. But I really want this Celebi to have really good IVs. I hope it does. Alright, so Oddish is down. Next one. Fungus, get out of here. I hate seeing him. One, two, three. All right, here we go. Next catch is Celebi. Oh, this, this is going to be so much. All right, a thousand, 500 Stardust, 1,000 XP. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh, there it is. Shiny Celebi on my screen right now. Let me close out the stream I'm watching. Oh, where'd you go? There it is. The only thing I hate about this is actually trying to hit it. And look, there's the camera I use. One. Oh, okay, come on. Where'd you go? Alright. So, two balls. And now I need to hit one more time, and then I officially catch Shiny Celebi. Alright, it pops out. Alright, let's try to do a curveball on the last one. That's not going to work very well, is it? Where'd you go? There you are. Alright, I'm just going to throw it and hit him. <laughs> I'm not going to waste all the balls. Alright, here we go. One, two, three. Shiny Celebi caught in Pokemon Go. This is so exciting. Okay. Oh, I'm so scared to click OK. Oh my god, this is horrible. Uh, it's actually okay, but I am so happy about this. I can finally finish this video. If you guys enjoyed it, hit that like button, subscribe button, and turn on your post notifications so you know when I upload. Other than that, guys, I will see you in the next one. Shiny Celebi, guys.